Hi, I'm Bas and today for Red Shark, I'm going to talk to you about timecode and synchronization. So I'm going to do a very simple run through of our current NanoLocket synchronized setup. But before that, let's start with why you would actually want to use a synchronized timecode. And actually that answer is quite simple. It's to synchronize your separately recorded audio together with your uh, video. Or you can make it even more complex and have multiple cameras on your shoot and multiple sound recordists. And you want to make sure that everything is synced quite easily so that in the edit you can start right away. Our camera, the RED, has an internal mic so we could actually use the waveform to sync up both the sound recordist's audio and the camera audio. But in practice, it's actually not that simple because normally the camera operator could be a lot further away or the internal mic wouldn't pick up enough that you actually have enough information to sync that up. So then uh, the editor has to do that manually, which takes a lot of time and time is money. So it's probably easier to show it to you than to uh, actually talk about it. So here are two nano lockets from Ambience. They can be used to synchronize a uh, timecode between the camera and the audio recorder. What we need to do is to actually synchronize the timecode from the recorder uh, with the timecode of the camera. And you have to set up your camera in such a way that it will uh, take uh, the external timecode instead of its own internal timecode and you have to do that the same thing for the audio recorder. When you have set up that basis, you've done that, uh, we can start synchronizing these two. So what you do, press both of these buttons and wait. So now you see that they're flickering but it's not synchronized. And on one of these two, you have to click on the green button, click, keep them closed so that they can actually sync. And now you see that they actually are completely synchronized. Now, when you do this, these two boxes are actually continuously communicating with each other and making sure that there's not a frame dropped. So they're like frame locked completely. So what you do then is one of these is going onto the camera like that very professionally done. And the other one is actually going into the audio recorder, like that. And now both of these are synced, so they have the same time codes. Now these devices have their own internal battery and you can charge them quite easily with a micro USB and they'll actually last for 35 hours. So I think they did a tremendous job uh, because that means that you can actually uh, use them for a whole day without having to worry about it. And actually, that's that. It's that simple. Um, all of your devices are now uh, synchronized on timecode. And you can actually easily make this bigger, get more nano lockets in, synchronize more devices on a multi-camera shoot. And uh, yeah, it's a really easy to use system.